Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm gonna be filming a quick um, like flip of the planner I'm using right now. This is my A5 Aura Estelle. Um, originally, I was housing her in this one that I got off Amazon, but I actually know I was, sorry, give me a second. I was using this very pretty um, cover I won from Planner Monkey Co. But yeah. And before that, I was using this one. So I was in my, my rings for a oh, while. Wow, I love my rings. Do not get me wrong. It's like my go-to for when I need it. But right now, I've been having the urge to like, um, let me adjust my chair and this. I've been having the urge to like memory keep um, as I'm planning. So right now I'm just following it. I was in my commit 30. I wanted more space to decorate and to write, but I also wanted a memory keep. So I decided rings was not going to help me get there. Um, let me show you guys real quick. If I can show you one of these that's completed. Hold on just a second. Um... I don't know if you can see it. Hold on, give me a second. I feel like this is all private. Yeah, most of this is private, that's why I can't show you. So I was like starting to memory keep in this really pretty layout, but I just know that when I'm done with the month and I pull them out, I'm gonna throw them away. And I don't wanna waste my stickers on that because I don't know. Sometimes I like to look back on them. I have a ton of bullet journals, but I rarely look back on them so I can see both sides. I could see me like using this, throwing it away, like the dailies. But for now, I'm just going with what I wanna go with right now. And I found these cute, very cute stickers from the Dollar Tree. So this is a cool little booklet they had in the front. And then I just bought these. You're gonna see a lot of these because they're covering up my spreads because they're private. But um, in this type of planner, you can use this. So you don't need to because you'll have enough space for a week. But I'm just trying to say um, this was really good for me in the Commit 30 because even though I was planning out my week, this gives you like an overview so you could see it in the front. So these are actually pretty cool for the Commit 30. And my Commit 30, is so used up. It has every like memory in it. It has a little dent. Like I love this planner, but it's really what I would use for memory keeping, which of course. And then by the way, you'll never guess, I went back to the <laughs> my Hobonichi weeks and I loved it. Um, let me just show you guys. I remember my construction. I ripped out everything. It was crazy, but I love love the hobo weeks paper so it's hard to like let go anyway not ordering any of those okay so in this planner um i just have the paper shy paper shire stickers in the front i've got some cute pins left i'm going to show you guys the sheets since i'm probably going to use them up right so i have this um i think these were my bible study ones which i was really into doing my bible study and then i got too busy but it was so nice to do um and then this is like chores these are to match my husband and i uh yeah and then walking super mom this was a freebie from planner monkey co because i won the giveaway and then, yeah, I'm like almost done with the coffee ones. These are very cute stickers. I use them all the time. That's why I wanted to like keep them. So in the front, let's see if you can, if I can adjust it well. There we go. In the front, I just have my basic stuff. I just move it over. Like you guys can tell in every video, I always move over my names. I have some stickers and then my daughter, my oldest made me this and I laminated it like years ago. So I thought it would look pretty in the pocket. I've got like letters and stuff. This one I taped in from Planner Monkey Co. And yeah, um, so this is from Planner Monkey Co too. This one says, you are born to be real, not to be perfect, which I like a lot. So in the beginning, I just, there's an overview and I love putting stickers here. So that's like my favorite thing. 
This planner is actually undated. So I started in May and it ends in April, okay? So that's why I like this planner so much is because it's undated and also because um, you can do whatever you want in it and I'll show you guys in a minute. But this is like for the, I believe the 12 months and I never figured out what on earth to use this for. And if you have any ideas, leave them in the comments below because I have no idea like what I would track for the month, maybe like forward planning, right? I was thinking forward planning, but I just don't, I just don't want to like plan in here. I don't know. I don't want to mess it up. So that's what prevents me from using them. So I'm going to go ahead and jump to the month we're in right now. So this is my October spread for the month. And yeah, this comes with a cute ribbon thing. I just used these scripts from RSL and I decorated these with, give me a quick second, I will show you. I don't even know if I have the sticker book with me. Yes, this sticker book, it's all about the journey, it has pin marks on it, but it's like for the months. So pretty. So I've used up like everything from September and I feel like I used, no, I didn't. So the ones that I'm excited to use are November's. Yeah, I used up November. And then December, then I still have January, February, March, and April. Then I should have a new planner if I still love this planner. Okay, so basically um, I put in a habit tracker and I couldn't glue it in like I did with the other one. So next month I will use a different habit tracker so it glues in. And yeah, so the next one I have is like November and I just, for December, I'll be honest, I don't have anything. Like even, <laughs> which I should do that, right? I just can't commit. I can't commit and I always like, I wanna leave it undated in case I wanna use it later. You know what I'm saying? Like I can't commit, which is bad. But you can see the rest, January. And these little tabs I got from her shop, so pretty, February. And then March, and we got the last month, April. So I didn't start it at an ideal time, but that's just the way it goes. So I'm gonna show you guys this week which I already covered with these, like I told you. I wrote down my assignments for class, and then this is my daily today, which I found an exam sticker, so cool, in this humongous, I think, yeah, here, no, this was birthday. I don't know, it was in one of these I found an exam, and I just, I got a good grade, so I was excited. Um, so yeah, pretty much, I just go day by day, and I try to pre-plan and stuff, but, I mean, I just tipped this in. So, I tipped this in from, hold on, from this. So, I always have like an A5 and I just, Celogy, and I just go to the back and I rip out a page. And that way I can like preserve the notebook as much as I can because I might end up using it, right? I don't know what I'll need that notebook for. So, I tipped that in with just tape. And I just write, like I kind of write whatever I want because I also want stuff like my plants and meals. Maybe I want to write like a quote or just journal or something. I don't know what I want to do. So I just kind of took it in. And then real quick, I'm going to show you guys what, um, not what my weekly, no, this right here. So... I stopped using this for a long time and I feel like I wasted these pages. If I hadn't like written anything, you know, cause I was trying to plan ahead, I would have had these pages. So if you're debating on whether or not you should switch planners and stuff, maybe just don't date ahead like for the next week. Cause I knew the week before I didn't want to use this anymore, which is why I use this, like these headers. Otherwise I'm like really careful with my headers because that's just you know planner girl like I'll, I'll try to make them pretty or you know something so i think that if you just resist the urge <laughs> to like destroy a spread i'm kidding um 
And then one of these two, which I think I can show you guys this one. Um, I was pretty planning. And then I, I tipped this in from Peanuts Planner Co. Because I would do that with my weeks. And then, then I just stopped. As you could tell, like, I just kind of stopped using it. And then I kind of, you know. So, yeah, just just to let you guys know, um, I love this planner. It is beautiful. Like, there's nothing bad to say about this planner. There's only good things to say about it. So, I was frustrated that I couldn't really, like, keep up. And so, here was the problem. If you want to get down to, like, the nitty-gritty, I didn't like that there was white space. And I wasn't using the entire column. So, now I just really don't let that bother me. I used to really not like it. But in my past week... I don't even know if I can show you guys. Give me a sec. I feel like this one is not this like private. So we can look at like, I don't even think that's private either. Yeah, cool. Some of these have um, like journal entries. So I'm not gonna show, but this is perfect. So this is last week's spread and I have so much space right you can see that like I didn't go back I didn't put pictures or anything like that because I don't want to I just want it to look like this and I've started to like embrace that I'm not going to use all the space as long as like you're using it I feel like like the reason I like this so much is the paper the crinkling like turning the pages and the size so I think this is really cool um I will tell you though I miss my rings because of how full the pages are and one daily of these can fit like half of this if you write small like or just normal so that's what i'm trying to tell you guys like i do miss that in my rings but i'm getting used to it and um i think what will make it better is if i start putting pictures in i think then i will really begin to like it and i'm going to start like accumulating like journaling stuff maybe if i use like journaling and like practice that's like therapeutic you know so i've been thinking about that okay let's get to the back sections because i need to wrap this video i have to pick up my youngest soon so back here i have my gratitude which i did may and june for because i have those stickers but i'm not going to continue it i might i might continue it i just don't feel the urge to do that because i have so much space in my dailies that i can write like my what I'm grateful for for that day or I can tip in like a stology paper and do it for that month up there that's the only reason why I didn't continue and this is a cute piece of vellum you can add by the way you can add anything in this planner like you can add so much like vellum and stuff and I just haven't really gotten into it so just give me like I don't know like maybe two or three more weeks and I'll probably start printing and adding things in so yeah okay so this is my daughter's section that has like her just her curriculum info and stuff for school and then this is my other daughter nothing's on there because i haven't transferred all my notes because like i said i've been like should i be in this planner should i not should i be should i not and i i just told you guys i was in my hobo weeks so that's why then i have like a page for conferences and then this is for school which has passwords that's like it like i literally don't need anything else <laughs> I don't, so now that I've realized that, it's been a lot easier to switch my planners around. So I think that's when I was like, oh, I could use any planner. I just have like four sections basically that I don't use a lot. And then I have sticky notes here and private pages back here. I have like Planner Monkey Co. stickers and I use the adhesive I won in her giveaway, which I can't find these at the Target Dollar Spot. Just let you guys know. So I'm gonna check how much minutes, yeah, this is 13 minutes. Um, so that's pretty much everything. I'm going to upload this video. I hope you guys enjoy the flip. And the next one I want to do is I want to actually plan with you guys in one of my upcoming videos. Like I want to sit down and like go day by day and put the stickers out. The only problem with that is sometimes I don't like the layout after the week is over or like before the week starts and I just don't like so much stickers. So I think what I, I'm going to watch like a couple more videos and like maybe do, maybe do like, okay, so one full week and then do another full week. Then do a, do like a flip of that and then do, um, me planning the next week. 
because then I'll have more of a planner style. Right now, I'm just tipping in right now for my schoolwork. So convenient. But I wonder, I just wonder if I should do more. So we will see. So far, this is like more than enough what I need. I have gotten behind on grocery um, shopping lists and pre-planning. So that's very frustrating. I don't know why. But in my rings, I always plan ahead. Like there's no, there is no way I do not, you guys. And let me just, hold on, give me a quick second. Yeah, I can totally show you guys this one. So let me just, give me a sec. Okay. I don't know what's on there. So on, on these weeklies that I absolutely love, I do my meals, my to-dos, my schedule that I check off. You guys, I'm, now I want to get back in here. I'm like, I don't know why I did this video. And I love it. Like I, it's so simple, but you can throw it in your bag. I just, I don't throw it in my bag, you know? I don't. And then my dailies. Oh, as you can see here. Meal ideas. I was always on top of it. I knew it. So this is uh, the September from SM Plans. But I like love this so much. You guys, I like want to use it right now. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> okay, I'm going to stop this video. But I want to use this planner so bad right now. Like, you guys know how it is with these planners. I went into so much detail on these. Like, if only you could see because I'll uh, picked out, let me see, hold on, let me read this real quick. Mm, volleyball, yes, cool, I can show you this. So I was putting these little stickers from all the journey one and I was like going, like my dailies are so pretty. Like I, this is how I like them. Uh, I like dark pen on, because it's SM plans, otherwise I'd like a lighter pen because um, this grid is dark and I just love these dailies. Like they were my fave fave. And then I started to realize, oh my gosh, I'm using all my stickers and I'm not gonna keep this. But I love this planner, you guys. I should stop this video, huh? I probably made you guys switch into here and then switch into your rings. I'm gonna go now. Um, I will post soon. Talk, talk soon, bye.